Hi, I'm Yava from FinancialRatios.com and in this video I will provide you with a quick introduction of Altman Z-Score for non-manufacturer industrials and emerging market. So what is Altman Z-Score? First of all, it is a mathematic model used to evaluate the company's probability of bankruptcy within the next two years. This model was created by combining five different financial ratios calculated by using the accounting data of those companies that had already gone bankrupt in the past. The model itself was developed in 1968, but is still one of the most widely used ones. Later, this model was adapted to calculate score for non-manufacturing and emerging market companies by replacing market value of equity to the book value of equity and deleting sales to assets ratio. If the value of the Z-score is higher than 2.6, it means that the possibility of company's bankruptcy is very low, so the company is considered safe. This interval is known as the safe zone. Values that are between 1.1 and 2.6 represent the possibility of the company going bankrupt within the next two years. This interval is known as the gray zone. Now, if the value is below 1.1, it means that the possibility of a company's bankruptcy is high, so the company is considered unstable and dangerous. The interval is known as the distress zone. If the value of Altman Z-score goes down to 2.6 or below, it would be smart to consider paying serious attention to the company's condition. Now, how do we calculate the Altman Z-score for non-manufacturer industrials and emerging markets? Data that is needed to calculate this ratio is collected from the balance sheet, the income statement, the stock market bulletin, or the cash flow statement. In order to calculate this ratio, you have to first divide the working capital by assets and multiply it by 6.56, then add the retained earnings divided by assets and multiplied by 3.26, then add the EBIT divided by assets and multiply by 6.72 and lastly add equity divided by debt and multiply by 1.05. Now who might be interested in this model? The Altman Z-score calculations are not recommended for financial companies. This bankruptcy calculation model is important for the company's investors and creditors as well as owners as it provides information on how close the company is to a possible bankruptcy. Have in mind that this model does not calculate the exact probability of a company's bankruptcy. It is more of a statistics-based model, so you cannot rely on it alone. Thank you for watching, and see you in other videos.